What's going on, my dudes? Make sure you check out Prestige Labs for 30% off by using code Fitness and Gaming. They're a supplement company that does everything the right way. I think you guys will really enjoy it. All right, so check it out. Fitness and Gaming coming at you here. Another Destiny 2 video. I do have Chronos Zen settings in this video, even though I do not use Chronos Zen anymore. But I do want you guys to know that I am still supportive of people that have to use a Chronos Zen. Okay. The gameplay video that you are watching has a lot to do with this new pulse rifle that you get from the GM, the Grandmaster. Now, it's kind of hard because the Grandmaster is a little bit rough, so hopefully you can LFG, find yourself a decent group of guys that can take you through it. Maybe one or two chances or something like that because they take around 40 minutes each if you're like me and you're terrible at that type of content. But if you can get yourself a god roll horror's least, it is a game changer. There's no other way to put it besides this thing is a freaking rock star in pvp you will be running over the crucible i was getting multiple matches in a row where i'm going 9 kd one of them was 17 kd you just run over the lobby it doesn't matter you can bully anybody at mid-range it's wild so that is what i wanted to discuss with you guys first the horrors least going after it in the gm and try if you can to get a buddy that has the conqueror title seal because they can take you through a different GM. One of them that's not so crazy hard, like the um, the one that's currently being featured, is just awful. There's so many bugs in the thing, and I know there's a bunch of strategies and all that. Hey, do the strategy. Look at this. It works for me. None of that junk works for me, okay? I had to get a buddy of mine that has the Conqueror title so that we could go through a different GM so I could get the Adept version. I was incredibly lucky for once to get a God Roll version of this weapon. It's got heating up and kill clip, plus it's got a range masterwork. I'm in love. I, I can't say enough good things about it. You guys know I'm a pulse rifle main. I absolutely love pulse rifles that have the fully automatic mod, you know, a fast firing pulse. It's just, it's the best thing ever, man. It's like, you know, kid in a candy store kind of thing. Um, anyway, the Zen settings are listed right now. I want you guys to take a look. If you happen to use a Chrono Zen, you can take really good advantage of a weapon like this, especially one the thing has kill clip on it. The sidearm that I'm using is called Lonesome, that also has Kill Clip. Uh, it's the best perk in the game for PvP, so use it for everything, especially if you want to have a good old time. Okay, so, Horror's Least is a fast-firing post rifle, you get it from the GM. Um, one of the things that I want you guys to learn about this isn't just that it's good in PvP, but also the fact that this thing will be really good next season when Ark is the big thing. If you want to counter this weapon and you see more people using it, put on Risk Runner. I found a lot of success when people were shooting at me with a Horror's Least. If they put on Risk Runner, at least in the sense of survivability. If nobody has a Risk Runner and you have a Horror's Least, go man. Have a field day. It's amazing. Have a good old time. Uh, yeah, that's it. That's really it for this video. There's a bunch of gameplay footage if you guys want to watch of me using it. Again, I did not use a Chrono Send for any of this footage, but if you guys you know, are using it, again, I fully support you because it is a permissible thing. And until Bungie or anyone else says otherwise, yeah, use the heck out of it if you see fit, especially if you've got a disability of sorts, okay? If you have any questions, any comments, any concerns, leave them in the comment section down below. Thank you guys so much for your time. Love all of you. Remember to keep it done out there.